Hi, my name is Jasmine Vasquez, and here with me today I have David Razo, senior and former football player. Hi, David. Hi. <laughs> so, tell me about your football career. Where did it all start? Just tell me everything. Uh, well, it started back when I was nine years old. Uh, I was actually leaving a soccer practice because I used oh. to play soccer. And I walked by a football practice and I was like, wow, that's really exciting. You're going to hit people. <laughs> so that's how it started. I got really excited about hitting someone and not getting in trouble about it. And then from there on, it kind of just became something that I loved. And that's something that like matured me and something that helped me get through a lot of things in my life. Wow. So would you say that football... How would you say the influence from the coaches are on your football career? Uh, coaches are a big influence in your football career. Uh, football coaches make or break football players. So depending on whether a football coach is a good coach or a bad coach, it, uh, it creates a, either a bad player or a good player. So what would you distinguish between a good coach and a bad coach? A good coach is someone that's going to be hard on you but he's going to encourage you to become better and to show you how to become better. Motivate bad, you? Uh, yeah, and motivate you. A bad coach is someone that's going to be hard on you and just be hard on you. They're not going to show you the correct path. Can you tell me, have you had any experience with a good coach? Uh, a good coach, yes. Um, my former head coach, Coach Parra, he was a really good coach. He was extremely hard on me, but as a father, like kind of like a father figure. Mm -hmm. Because even though he was hard on me, he showed me how to become better and what is the correct way to do things. Yeah. And um, you play, obviously you play football at our school, Granada. Mm. And can you tell me an experience with a bad coach? Uh, yes, my freshman year, the summer going into my freshman year, uh, a coach of mine, my position coach, he actually injured me and ended my football career for a year. Can you describe to me that moment, if it's not too personal for you? No, it's fine. Um, so basically, one day, we were during the summer, we were practicing a drill, and he got really frustrated and jumped in the drill and actually hit me like full force. And this guy is about uh, over 20 years old. So, And I was a little kid and coming off a of Pop Warner team, so I was not ready for that. And that's what caused me to become injured, and that's what caused my... Um, torn ACL. So would you classify this as physical, verbal, and psychological abuse? Uh, definitely physical and psychological. Okay. Thank you so much. Nice talking to you. <laughs> nice talking to you. Okay.